legislation to that effect very shortly. Another core principle is that those coming to our country must embrace our values and love our people. And yes, we will build the wall. We've already started planning. It will be built. We will build the wall. We need it. We need it. We have to stop the drugs from blowing in. You know, people don't realize we're already spending a lot of money on design. But I'll give you an idea that nobody has heard about yet. And I'm not sure, but I'm a builder. That's what I love to do. That's probably what I do best. I'm a builder. And we're thinking of something that's unique. We're talking about the southern border. Lots of sun, lots of heat. We're thinking about building the wall as a solar wall. So it creates energy and pays for itself. And this way, Mexico will have to pay much less money. And that's good, right? Is that good? You're the first group I've told that to. It's solar wall. Makes sense. Let's see. We're working it out. We'll see. Solar wall panels. Beautiful. I mean, actually, think of it. The higher it goes, the more valuable it is. It's like... Pretty good imagination, right? Good. My idea. So we have a good shot. That's one of the places that solar really does work. The tremendous sun and heat, it really does work there. So we'll see what happens with that. That would be great. And I think we could make it look beautiful, too. It would really look beautiful. So that would be nice. Company submitted a blueprint design for solar panels on the border wall. And he joins us live here in Studio F. Good morning to you. Hi, Steve. This is genius. Well, we got together a group of creative people, designers, engineers, homeland security experts, finance people, and we were kicking around the idea, how do you get that border barrier built, and can't there be a generating uh, of revenue from that border barrier? And one of the engineers said, let's put solar on it. And he, he made a brilliant design. Right, because essentially by being a power generating station, the wall would offset the cost of the wall. It would defray the cost of the wall by 40 million to 400 million dollars annually, depending on how much per megawatt hour the market was. Okay, so we're looking at one of the designs right here. Explain what we're looking at. Well, we're looking at a, uh, a beautiful uh, rendition of the border barrier with the solar component. As you can see, it's, it's mesh, it's steel mesh. You can see through it. There's no uh, graffiti that can be put on it, and it has a solar gathering component that can generate a tremendous amount of megawatt hours, two sure. million megawatt hours per year. Unbelievable. And for it to go out like that and up like that, it would be hard to climb over. Exactly. Our engineers took a look at everything. They looked at the specifications, the security needs, and the, the solar gathering uh, materials that would be required, and they came up with a, a great design, amazing design. Here's one of the other things, aside from the fact that it would offset the cost of the wall, is the fact that it would wind up, you would think, because the political left loves things that are solar powered, they'd love this. Oh, wait a minute. We love it, but we hate it. We love it because it's solar powered, but we hate it because it's a wall. Exactly. And the, and the best thing about it is we could sell the energy to Mexico. So, in fact, they would be paying for the wall. <laughs> so it's a win-win-win.